Hello, Jennifer? Yeah. Hi. Well, on the phone here, we have Jennifer Madden Fabiano, and she's produced several shows on the Discovery Channel, Animal Planet, and HGTV. Uh, shows like America's Cutest Dogs, Extreme Houseboats, Must Love Cats, but we like to talk about real estate on this show, so uh, one of the shows is Spontaneous Construction, and that's a renovation home show that owners of the home have a room renovated, but have no choice about what the end result is. And um, they do a little fun flash mob dance yeah, with it. I watched the clip. <laughs> it's really fun. And uh, that's from Powder House Productions. And Jen is also a client of mine. We worked together when she bought her home in 2012. Welcome to our show, Jen. Hi. <laughs> nice to be here. Hello. How's Hi. it going? Hi, Jen. This is Hi. Jen. So um, I, I watched a little clip of your show. It's kind of cool. On HGTV's uh, website, however, they don't allow you to watch the full show. So is that the I only know. way to watch they it? They kind of tease you a little bit. Yeah, so um, you just have to. But yeah, the cool little show kind of tried to bridge the gap between you know television and social media. So they sort of try to activate a flash mob to sort of help with a lot of the the renovations. So like the big projects, like you know painting rooms or demo. You know if you have to break something down, uh, planning things, stuff like that. You know many hands make light work so so if i have a house yeah. to tear down uh, you guys will come over and tear it down for me <sighs> my god yeah i think they would really Th and that was all done by social media who, who pays for it um, I think it's a combination uh, of both. I mean, I think that um, a lot of the, you know, individual people, you know, like KitchenAid, if they're going to do a whole, um, you know, kitchen reno, a lot of times they'll donate their stuff, you know, but obviously they're getting advertisements on the show. And um, I think the show, I, you know, I don't know the ins and outs of all that, but, um, you know, the shows have budgets um, for that. But also I think in some cases the uh, homeowners would also, you know, they put money towards it as well. They only work with uh, end users, no developers? Contractors and stuff, yeah. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Because I have a couple houses to tear down, but it doesn't sound like it'll be right for the show. Maybe you should go on social media and ask people to bring their wrecking balls. Oh, I should do it for this show. <laughs> tear down the house for a real estate on Sunday. Yeah. So it's pretty cool. They they, they would just um, really do transform a space or an outdoor area, you know, in, in pretty quick amount of time. So it was pretty cool. So are all your shows on HGTV? It sounds like cute dogs uh, or something. That'd be on the Animal Planet. Yeah. No. Um. I I've done a variety of stuff, and I was in New York for a long time. But now that I'm uh, in Boston, I there's a local production company and based out of Somerville. Um, and so I did a lot of the lifestyle type of shows with them. I mean, they do a variety of stuff, but I tended to focus on um, the Animal Planet stuff, Travel Channel, stuff like that. But um, with them, I was able to do a um, show for HGTV. Um, they did 13 episodes. Um, so I, I, you know, I had the pleasure of working on that. So that was pretty cool. So who comes up with the idea? Is it HGTV, or do you come up with the idea, or your company comes up with the idea? All of those things, I think. Yeah, they, you know, they have, uh, you know, a development team um, at Powderhouse, and they have a lot of creative minds who come together and pitch shows to the variety of networks. Uh, um, and if they like them, you know, then they'll sometimes order a pilot, or you know, there's a variety of ways that they do things. Um, they tweak it a little bit, and then they don't order some episodes. But sometimes a client, you know, like HGTV, may come to a particular production company and ask them to, to produce a show. And so it, 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 it ha unfolds in a variety of ways. Yeah. Was that show only filmed in the Boston area? Yeah, they did one season. I don't know if they're, they're doing another season or not. Um, I think that I think there was just one season, but at the time, yes, they just um, they just did Boston, and then they did one show in New York after the hurricane. Um, oh, that's I, right. Yeah, didn't they do? Um, I think they really helped somebody out who had some you know pretty bad damage. Yeah, them. I think it was in. Um well, was it Staten Island, I think, or? I think so. Yeah, I, think. Yeah, I wasn't involved in that. Yeah. Um, but I think so, yeah.